15 years after the end of the reign of the noble Samanosuke. The clash between good and evil takes place on a new battlefield. The villain, Hideyoshi Toyotomi, has marshaled his Genma demons in feudal Japan. Soki and the other mystical samurai warriors must wage war, no matter what the cost. This is Onimusha, Dawn of Dreams, a different time and a different game from its predecessors, the Onimusha Trilogy. Onimusha was the first samurai game when PS2 was released. We wanted players who had never played samurai games before to understand Japanese history. We developed the series in three parts. This version, however, is different from the others in the series, and we wanted it to be new and distinct. In Onimusha 1, 2, and 3, the enemy had been Nobunaga. For this version, we concentrate on Hideyoshi's story, the lord who ascended right after Nobunaga. This helps separate this version from previous releases. To those Onimusha fans who think this game is merely a side story of the Onimusha series, I'll tell you right now, it's much more than that. I want fans to understand that this is the fourth self-contained installment. But the reason we didn't put a number on this game is we wanted to fundamentally change the contents of the game itself. Dawn of Dreams features a powerful and flexible new fighting system. It delivers lightning-fast action with five playable characters, each with their own special abilities and weapons. And best of all, you can now switch between two characters on the fly. Previous Onimusha users had been satisfied with the one versus one game, but we heard from many users, including those in the US, that they wanted to try some new things. At first, we simply increased the number of players, five players, including not only samurai, but also a priest, a gunslinger, and a street fighter. Each of these new players by himself would have had a difficult time fitting in the Onimusha universe, so we decided to pair them with traditional Japanese characters. One samurai and one of the other characters would expand Onimusha's action world. Therefore, we introduced the new pair system. So you can switch from one character to another in real time. In addition, while you play character A, for example, you're able to give commands to character B, which you aren't even playing at the moment. You can tell them to wait or whatever you want. The deeper the friendship between the two characters, the more efficiently they follow your orders. Stay over there! The new dynamic camera system allows you more freedom to move and explore throughout the feudal landscape. And when it's time for a battle, the action gets intense. Environments are constantly expanding as you learn more about each character and master each stage. Another feature of this game that the players enjoy is the stage system. In a pair of characters, each has a different gimmick. If the players can find and use those gimmicks, they will find another new stage and expand the story. And the new free camera system allows the player to view more of the stage dynamically. As you clear the map, you may want to switch from your old partner to a new partner in order to discover new items and find new story developments. Even if you're playing the same map over and over, you will find new situations. This installment of Onimusha is less linear than previously, so even if you think you've cleared the stage, the new features allow it to constantly expand and offer new discoveries. The battle rages. You must use your experience and rely on your samurai friends if evil is to be vanquished in Onimusha, Dawn of Dreams.